and sang songs as they searched for my grandfather's body. The same songs my ancestors sang on the Trail of Tears. You could hear the songs echo through the forest. I've wondered where the songs come from. I said in a joking way, well, I'm just going to bring a cassette deck in here and record it, and then you guys can tell me what it is. I didn't realize what that would lead me to, the whole rich story of American music history that had never been told. I found the email. This is Professor Willie Ruff, Yale University. I heard that Muskogee Creek hymns sounded like the Scottish hymns. Early American Christians were schizophrenic. They gave us the gospel and, and committed genocide at the same time. Those hymns are all about survival because they're taking Christianity, which in, in some sense was designed to break the community. And they're taking them and transforming them into something that sustains community. Our uh, people pulled a fast one on them. What would you say is the first American music? Is it Yankee Doodle that comes from England anyway? Are they the folk songs of the British Isles that become the Appalachian ballads that evolve into the earliest country music and cowboy songs? Is it the music of West Africa that evolves into American blues? Or might we say that it's Muscogee Creek hymns? Because they are the first musical form and the first musical product of the three major cultures that come together to make up what becomes the United States. 